study because these exams are really important, right? Apart from that, one thing is very, very important is to stay safe. Why? Because Corona is- Good morning, ma'am. Huh? Good morning, Padres. So Corona's, um, another sister has come by the name of, what is the sister's name? Omicron. Right. Omicron. So, so all the people are vaccinated. The only people that is are not vaccinated are you. You know, so higher possibilities that you might catch it. So very, very important. Stay safe, eat good food and protect yourself by eating good food, by exercising and all so that it boosts your immunity. All right. OK, great. So before we go ahead, <clears throat> before we go ahead and start the workshop, tell me in today's world, <clears throat> What is one of the thing because of which communicating with people has become much more easier? And we can connect with not just the people we know, but globally, the entire of the world. I'm by the mobile world. Yeah, you can connect yes. to the entire world by the mobile world. Yes, ma'am, that's you don't so know. Internet. Thank you so much, Sneha. So it is via the internet. So today's topic of the workshop itself is internet etiquette. We go ahead and use the internet all the time. We are on internet fixed. You know, a major chunk of our hour is invested in using the internet, you know. So when we are going ahead and using the internet, internet can be a blessing and it can be a curse as well depends on what you are using it for, you know? So very, very important that when we are going ahead and using the internet, there are certain restrictions, there are certain limitations to it. So we need to be very, very careful while handling the internet. Okay. So can anyone tell me what are some of the etiquettes we need to keep in mind while handling the internet? One, we should not use it for the wrong things. Uh, what do you mean when we tell wrong things? Kya hai wrong things? Wohi to kuch hai. Not to post it on social media. Our feelings are what they, I think. I'm sorry. Fir se bolna apne. And we should use internet in a very safe way so that our personal things that cannot be leaked. Thank you very much. So the first important thing that we need to take care of is not to provide too much of personal information. You know, so be it any kind of uh, uh, usage, be it for any use, we are not supposed to go ahead and put too much of in information on the internet because that information that you put on the internet is accessible to any and everybody. A lot of times what happens is, you know, we go ahead and send some photos because we want to show it to some of our friends of ours, right? And then just say post kara, we realize, oh my God, nahi page na chahiye, I'll delete it. You deleted it from that side, but it does not get deleted. Anything and everything that you put on the internet, no matter whether you've deleted it, it will always stay on cloud. So be very, very careful of what you are putting on the net because ek bar dala, chai kuch bhi karlo, the data is always stored somewhere else. So the first important thing about internet is not to go ahead and put excess of personal information. Okay? Yeah, someone else. Mom, we should not be rude or abusive. Right. The kind of language that we use, the kind of language that we use, we should not go ahead and use language which are abusive, which are, you know, crude, which are bad. Because the only reason being, 
जब हम दोस्तों को बोलते हैं कुछ भी when we are talking to our friends and we say anything bad they can see us they can see our body language right but anything which you put on the internet it does not come with the body language therefore it might come across as very very rude even a lot of times what happens is hum message karte hai hamare doston ko right and they get angry with us with the kind of message that we have written but they have actually written a genuine message but why because that message did not come with uh, the body language ki kis tarike se likha hai you know they people have entered into fights so the usage of language should be very very professional if it is professional a lot of people what happens is when you look on facebook or any other social media जो मन करे वही कमेंट करे जाते राइट दे डोंट इवन केयर दैट पीपल आर रीडिंग दिस मैसेजेस कभी कितने गंदे गंदे मैसेजेस लिखते हैं एंड दे डोंट इवन केयर अबाउट हाउ द अदर पर्सन माइट बी फीलिंग एंड आई हैव सीन अ रियल केस हैपनिंग वेर इन देर वॉज अ बॉय हु वॉज आई थिंक फिफ्टीन ईयर्स ओल्ड मैक्सिमम ही वॉज अरेस्टेड फॉर अ डे just because he wrote something negative which made that girl take a negative action so be very very careful of what you post on social media the language uh, the verbiage it is very very important yeah next what else a lot of times what happens is in the internet when we are uh, you know talking when we are watching the internet when we are looking at the internet a lot of times kya hota hai internet mein wo aata hai this video is not suitable for children uh, below 18 years aur hum 18 years below nahi hai par dekhte hai yaar kya hai mon karta hai aur dekhne ka ki kya hota hai dekho zara right very very important that you don't go ahead and watch video which is not age appropriate the very reason wo reason wo likhte aise hai because there are certain content on those social media social sites or any internet platform your youtube video that are not suitable therefore they write that right but humme kya hota hai janne ki eagerness to know what is happening kya hota hai dekhte hai so never go ahead and watch what is not age appropriate okay i i remember of a story there was uh, one lady okay and uh, she and one person met on the internet and they started going ahead talking 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 and while talking with one another they built a relationship okay a relationship which was just ba- based on the internet you know and that girl had gone ahead and transferred i think around about 3 4 lakhs to this person you know and after getting the money transferred the person was not there on um, that facebook site he was he did not even exist we did not even know so it was a fake identity a lot of time you children also what happens if you all have facebook accounts we are busy making friends of the people we don't know also ghar ke paas jo rehte unka itna pata nahi par hum facebook mein hamara numbers increase karne ki increase karte rehte karte rehte karte rehte tell me how many people have more than 100 friends in their facebook mom i don't have have an id i'm okay, same good. same mom same here mom no same here Oh, great. So those people who don't have an ID, very good. But those 
people who have an ID because see, eventually you will be growing up. Bade ho gaya, right? So you will be, you know, what we basically do as people, we go to the profile of the person, okay? We like the photo, oh, it's good. Accept it. Oh, it's good to see it. Accept it. Oh my God, it's a profession. Accept it. But how much is true? How much is untrue? Mm -hmm. We don't even know. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. मैम जैसे फेसबुक पे आप कह रहे हो कि हमारी आईडी नहीं होनी चाहिए मैम अपने मैम लेकिन मेरी तो मेरा जो अपना फोन है उसमें मेरी मम्मी की आईडी मतलब लॉगिन है तो ऐसे नहीं कि हम किसी भी फोटो पर लाइक कर दें बस अपने रिलेटिव जिनको हम जानते हैं उस पर लाइक कर Okay, that's a very good thing, Yash. But a lot of times what happens, you see your mother is there. It's her ID. She she's always there to monitor. because it's not your own id but when you grow up what will happen is you'll create your own id you'll have your own circle of friends you know i remember of a child who was in class 12 i think in one of the schools that i go to he had 1200 friends and i questioned him out of that 1200 friends how many do you know he said ma'am i think i know around about 100 k thoda sa upar So what about the rest of the people, ma'am? I don't know. So what's the purpose of keeping it? It is ma only leaving the followers. It is only a way of troubling yourself, because usme se kitne achhe milenge tumhe, kitne achhe nahi milenge, and what kind of a conversation you have is also very very important. if you make someone a friend in your friend list uh, which is like 1200 in number you know do you think <clears throat> they can misuse your photos they can misuse anything tumara photo if you are in uh, suppose for example if i and yash ki mummy are friends i can download a photo i can take a screenshot take a print out do whatever i want to with the photo so that's why i'm saying very very important to be very very careful with what we put on social media a lot of times i've seen people giving personal informations like their mobile numbers okay and they are the only people who say are mere ko na itna zyada sales call aata hai kisne kaha tha social media mein dalne ke number a lot of people say oh i get so many junk mails why because obviously you have given your personal information to someone who actually took the advantage of it and you know it just got circulated multiple times i in fact had to change i remember i in fact had to change my uh, email id just because there was nothing besides junk mail so very very important what we are putting on the internet a lot of times what we do is people forget people don't know but it seems jaise when we are writing a comment a lot of people have the habit of writing in capital letters koi bhi shabd jaise likh rahe beech mein bade bade capital letters mein likhte hain but when we write in capital letters it does not come as good it comes as negative it comes as if you're shouting at that person but do we know no so very very important when we are writing we need to be very very careful with what we are writing because when we go ahead and write in capital letters uh you know it means that you are shouting some people simply use caps kitne log to pura sentence hi pura comment hi cap letter mein likhte throughout their email ids we need to go ahead and stop that because that is not the right way uh what else what else are some of the things that we should not be doing on social media a lot of times what also happens logo ko rai dene ka bahut man karta hai chahe kuch bhi ho 
right? If there is a certain person who has posted something on religion, you know, who's gone ahead and posted something on religion, what happens is uh, people start giving their comments, start giving their comments, you know? And they, I remember I think Jamia me. Uh, I think before Corona started in 2019 or 18. And um, uh, everyone said there was a mass gathering which happened in Jamia. So uh, it was very, very important. But at the same time, it was religion say related. So the media had, uh, there was a lot of crowd. Okay. And uh, the media person had gone. And he was questioning the people in the media. The media person was questioning all the people who had come to that um, protest, you know. And then he questioned, the media person questioned, Aap aai kyo ho yaan pe? Aray, I saw it on Facebook, I said it was a bad thing, that's why I went to the media. You know, doing things without knowledge is very, very dangerous. Some people said, my friend said it was a friend, so I came to the media. So very, very important that when we are using the net, we need to be very, very careful of what we are doing, what we are not doing. For example, even when I'm, we are taking online classes, the first basic etiquette is to go ahead and turn your cameras on. I see 90% of the children never turn their cameras on, which is a wrong internet etiquette despite teacher going ahead and telling you, turn the camera on, turn the camera on, you still don't listen. And you start giving us reasons, ma'am, internet poor hai. Are gaon mein thore rehte hai, jo itna zyada internet ki dikkat roz hoti hai? Yes or no? The first, this talks a lot, this talks about how professional, how good you are as an individual. The first important rule is only to go. The first important rule is only to go ahead and turn your cameras on. Cameras on hai. So what happens when we turn the camera on? It is we get a connection. We feel that connection. Otherwise, it seems as if we are talking to the walls. But no matter how many times we say, you never listen. A lot of times what happens is, um, even in Facebook or anywhere, people have updated their profiles, which are like 10 years purana, and they have not changed. For example, let's take an example. Um, a person, okay, is working. I remember I made um, some calls to hire people, okay? When I made those calls and hired people and I am checking their profile because I liked it, you know, I said, you are last working with Google. And they say, ma'am, 10 saal pehle karte the. To phir update kyun nahi kiya hai? So it's very, very different. Ye nahi ki, hello, uh, I'm looking, um, mene phone kiya aur dusre ko bola ki, you know, this is the opening we have. Par ma'am, mein to Punjab mein rehti hoon. Punjab mein rehti ho, to Dilli ka address kyun thala hai? Very, very important, like you all. When I first came to your class, I used to, uh, you know, get confused because kitne bachcho ne apna na sex class hi nahi change kara hai. Aadhe to 8B, 8A, 8D, 8E likha ho hai. I used to think, kai bachche 8 ki to nahi aagai hai, galti se. Kyunki tum log 9th pe ho. There are very few people who have changed it to class 9A. Right? So it creates a confusion so that it is not create confusion. It is very, very important to keep informations on the forum, which are present abhi jo jaha pe ho. So very, very important is to update information and keep updating it so that people are aware. Linden pe profile bana ke bethe lo aur ka banaya hua profile hai aur usme se kuch bhi right nahi 
Why? Because they don't update it. I remember I called her up. I was looking at a LinkedIn profile and a resume. And while I was looking at her resume, it uh, showed that she had worked with a company uh, called, I think, InfoVision. So I said, you've worked with InfoVision for six years. Oh, I'm sorry, six months. Why did you leave? And then she's shocked. Oh, ma'am, I to so just imagine what kind of impression would it create? She was trying to remove it to show that ki mere stability hai because six months is not a good duration to work. So very, very important to update the right information on the forum. A lot of times what happens is you need, what whenever you get um, emails emails which will be mails at I you need to respond to emails quickly uh, we and whenever we are writing have you written any applications of leave agar tum logo ko chutti chahiye application dikhte ho ma'am school yes ma'am so yes, what does that what does that application need to have Ma'am, uh, the application will inform that person that we are not coming that day, so that uh, he, uh, he or she would know that we are not coming that day. Okay. And so, do you think we are supposed to write a long one or a short one, crisp and to the point? Ma'am, uh, sure. along with the point, like a point would be clear and sufficient for understand the top uh, to understand what we have written in our application ma'am the application should be appropriate it should be appropriate it should be short it should be crisp and it should be very very uh, simple. It is a professional manual that we are writing to the school. So whenever we are writing to school, to authority, the mail should not be itna lamba lamba. It should be very short, crisp, and to the point. Okay. Another important thing. Um, a lot of times, yeah, what happens is whenever, you know, uh, whenever we get a message, for example, um, about anything. How many people read? Binna read kare. Oh, achai forward kar deta. Achai forward kar deta. Achai forward kar deta. So we don't even check the authenticity of what we are forwarding. For example, um, they say that, you know, yehi uh, Omicron virus, yo bhi aaya hai. Mm, that virus is spreading rapidly. And uh, like, um, let's take an example, round about 40 people have been, uh, 40 people ko ho gaya hai Delhi mein, aur na, ye bohat rapidly increase kar raha hai, to government mind, uh, government is planning to get the school shut down or something like that. We don't even check the authenticity of the mail, kisne bheja hai. We don't even, that person who has forwarded will also not check the authenticity of the mail. But kya karenge? Hum bina soche samje, wo SMS ko forward karte jayenge, karte jayenge, karte jayenge. And then we have already entered into a vicious circle wherein sabil ko galat femi ho gaye. So very, very important. We need to check the authenticity of the meal. Okay. Yeah. Uh, what else are some of the things that we need to ke be careful about? It is only I who is doing the talking. Ma'am, I think that much. Only that much? The way we write short forms, TTYL, and I'm pathetic with that, okay? So most of the people have the habit of writing TTYL. Do you know what is TTYL? Thank God you don't know. I I'm equally bad, don't worry. So TTYL is talk to you later, okay? And I did not know. Now we I have got the hang of it and I'm trying to learn. 
but we should never use such abbreviations which people are not even aware of one day one of my friends wrote you know uh, i am not coming because my mil is at home now i am on wondering what is mil what is mil and then i had to write because it made no sense to me what does mil mean and it seems stupid at times you know so she said oh my god tripti it means mother in law okay so such words which is non understand by understandable by a common person uh, you know it is better to use simple correct words and rather than the short forms of the words you know which actually is becoming a trend these days right a lot of times we write because at coz uh, we have the habit of you know shortening the correct words into smaller you know words uh, can you give me some of the examples mom tbh what is tbh now mom to be honest mom oh, asap yeah. as soon as possible yeah as soon as possible yes mom dnd mom do not disturb okay yeah so such words and i mean to say also words like hum just jaise normally likh rahe hote tab bhi bhi jab hum likhte hai na because becomes because b e c a u s e mam we write mam we write uh, y o u s on y o u s on u i'm sorry mam only letter u okay yeah you we write why you you as you you know and then i wonder what's the use of studying in a school then because jo padha hai aur hame teachers hamesha school mein bolte hai learn the spellings learn the spellings learn the spellings and look what is happening nowadays tod madod ke likh dete hai sab kuch mam bhi cause ko bhi likhte hai mam b c z i'm sorry mam bhi cause ko bhi likhte hai mam bhi cause ko bhi likhte hai Mam B C Z. Yeah, B E C Z, and these are with ko lik dete hai W I D. Okay, so all. Mam number ko lik dete hai. Mam I D K. Mam I D K. I don't know. Yeah. So if someone writes me something like this with a page, I will not be able to understand anything. To be honest, you know. So very very important to write something that is. known to everybody right and uh, i sometimes uh, find it surprising that we have entered into a world jab hum chote the when we were small we always were told have a good handwriting have a good writing hamara handwriting bahut sundar acha hona chahiye tha and i always used to put that effort to write neatly and well but now with the invention of the internet किसी का राइटिंग डज नॉट मैटर ऑल दैट मैटर्स इज योर टाइपिंग स्पीड यस और नो हाउ फास्ट और हाउ स्लो यू राइट या एग्जैक्टली सो लाइफ चेंजेस एंड थिंग्स चेंजेस बट देयर आर सर्टेन नॉर्म्स और देयर आर सर्टेन थिंग्स वी नीड टू गो अहेड एंड टेक केयर ऑफ व्हेन वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट द इंटरनेट एटिकेट राइट Uh, and the yeah yes. and a lot of times kya hota hai someone writes a threatening message to you koi dhamki de raha hai hota hai to uske ego pe lag jati hai wo baat itna zyada logo ko ego pe cheez chali jati hai kisi ne na kuch rude or threatening message likh diya ye le tune ek likh diya na main jawab deta hu tujhe aur usne likh diya fir dusre insaan ko acha nahi lagta फिर वो भी लिख देता है उसका आगे का जवाब सो यू नेवर रिस्पॉन्ड टू रूड और थ्रेटनिंग मैसेजेस बिकॉज एट द एंड ऑफ द डे टू थिंग्स इट विल डू यू विल एंड अप इन टू अ मेस नंबर वन नंबर टू यू आर स्पॉइलिंग योर ओन इम्प्रेशन एंड इमेज अबाउट योर सेल्फ right if you all have laptops in your home it is very very important that you need to have a virus scanner a good virus scanner installed 
And whenever you, uh, you get, whenever you grow up and you make your profiles, watch out for people who are pretending to be someone else. A lot of time, you know, uh, people have this name of actor, actresses as the face, you know, and they say, think, ah, you say, what could I have to do? Because some say, kisi ke pas time nahi hota. They keep a PA to respond to those messages also. So don't be, don't use your brains. I know common sense is, people, we all have been gifted with common sense, but we, use, we don't use it. That's so uncommon, you know? So very, very important. Number one, social media, mein, you should not be addictive. You should not uh, dig on your study time. That means a lot of times what happens, a lot of people when they go on social media, ke baad, they don't come out. You know, a lot of times what happens, we all go on holidays, right? We go on holidays and we take um, a trip to this beautiful place. So what happens the moment we get up, uh, uh, suppose I'm planning to go, let's say Shimla, for example, okay? Morning I get up, I brush my teeth, I kick a selfie and I post it on Instagram. Hey, got up, yeah? And then, and then we tie our shoes. Photo Hichliya Jutega. Hey, hashtag getting ready. Yeah. Then we sit in the car, hashtag ready to go. And then we reach the hotel. We open, we open the balcony uh, and we see that beautiful view. Hashtag view from my balcony. Right? Or din bhar ye din din mein, shimla mein many jitna photo kicha hai na, kichliya. So what I'm doing is I'm actually not enjoying the beauty where I am, but I'm busy clicking photos and capturing moments. And then also after that 50 photos I have clicked, I'll say, start selecting. Kwanza chai. Kwanza slide photo chai. Ha, ye sahi. Then what do I do with that photo? I'll try to Photoshop it by making the light dim, by making it black and white. And then I post it on social media. Then what happens? Are yaar. Bas do like aye. Itna sundar photo dala to tha. Right? And then after what's two hours ke baad. Are yaar. Bas do hi comment mile. Yaar photo hi gandhi hogi. Dusra change kar leti. So to be honest. What we are doing. We are busy trying to impress people, right? So don't, never ever in life do that. Never ever do like that in life. You know what are the norms we need to follow while we are using the internet and stick to those norms because the more we stick to the protocols of internet etiquettes, the more safe we become. The more we misuse it, the more bad it is for us. So very, very important. Internet handling plays a very important role in our lives, all right? Okay, so Amir wants to share a story. Ma'am, one of my friends also write long words to short words like thank you to a T H N U. Right. So very, very important. Acceptable. Jo acceptable hai, jo auro ki samajh mein aaye, wo language use karna bohat zyada zaruri hai. Because when you actually go in the professional world and start working, a and D may be wo sign at the in the laptop. We cannot use that yeah. sign most of the times. We have to use long words. And if I go out, you know, and try to test people on spellings, trust me, half of the people will not know the spellings. Why? Because they're so accustomed to using short forms in life. So tell me, what are some of the benefits if we handle internet carefully? Uh, 
Where we can keep our things personal and only to us and our friends. All right. And but what is the benefit? Uska fayda kya hai hoga? Ma'am, kiska fayda ek baar repeat kar do. What are the benefits of using internet effectively? Ma'am, or Ma'am, if we do not understand anything in our studies or anything in knowledge, so ma'am, we can get that knowledge from internet. Thank you. Very good. Internet is not only a curse, it is the blessing as well. A lot of times, in our time, the internet is not so much. So, if you don't get a question, ask it. Ask it. If you don't know it, then ask it to someone else. Right? But the internet is a blessing. If you don't know anything, Google it out and Google Baba will give you all the answers. Right? So, what happens is it gives you, you gain knowledge from the internet if you use, the, if you make the right usage, right? But at the same time, because we are so much dependent on the internet, our thinking skills have become zero. We don't think at all, right? So if we can gain knowledge, we'll protect ourselves from any danger. Right, because if you are aware about how to use the net, then you protect yourself. You're safeguarded, right? What is the third benefit? By using the internet, we can explore the things. Thank you very much. So you connect globally. You connect to the entire of the world. But you need to be careful. I'm not saying don't connect, but we need to be careful. As a result, you'll have better relationship, better connections with people, right? Very good. What else? Give me two more. Uh, we can buy products uh, with the help of internet. Okay. So it becomes more convenient, more efficient for... Last one. Ma'am, we can pay our bills also today's internet. Okay, more efficiency. Oh. Efficiency comes with that only. What else? Ma'am, I want to know Hello? Yeah, one last one. Um, we can transform yes, all right so children these are some of the benefits that we have if we go ahead and use the internet effectively all right so it is very very important it is a blessing as well as a curse if you use it the right way it will always add on to its value right but if you use it ineffectively it will always cause a lot of mishappenings and it will always be a threat. So very, very important that we go ahead and handle the internet effectively. All right? Excuse me, ma'am. Yes, Peter. Actually, we are uh, having a class at night. Yeah, yeah, I'm done. So thank you so much, okay, everyone. Take care. Bye-bye. Have a nice thank day. Thank you, teachers. Have a nice day, ma'am. Have a good day, ma'am. Have a nice day, ma'am. Have a nice day, ma'am. Have a nice day, man. Nice day, man.